Hello, and thank you for joining us today for Booking.com's webinar, How to Turn Your Booking.com Page into the Perfect Shop Window. To start, my name is Elizabeth Setsky. I am an account executive in the Chicago office, and I will be hosting today's webinar. Today, we will be looking at why your page matters, what makes an attractive booking.com page, and how to use your page to increase bookings. To start, why your page matters. Think of your page as, as your shop window. Given the two photos presented, which of these would you like to go into? When viewing your properties page, potential new customers use photos and other content on your page to help them decide which property they would like to stay at as well. Goldfish have famously short memories, only nine seconds, while humans are just as bad when it comes to paying attention when browsing on screens, only 10 seconds. That means that you just have a short amount of time to grab your customer's attention quickly. Otherwise, they'll simply click away and that potential business is lost forever. Booking.com's page is optimized to grab users' attentions quickly. This is about seeing the full picture. Guests see your property on multiple different websites. Lots of guests research on a range of different websites. Today's online purchase journey is rarely a straight line. Most digital savvy travelers don't plan, search, and purchase trips at the same time. Instead, the various stages of the customer's travel purchase funnel proceeds it in fits and starts, skipping and jumping between different websites, devices, and purchase sessions. So what they see on one OTA could end up influencing their final decision. If they like the content they see on booking.com, they might end up going directly to the hotel website and making a booking there. However, if they see a mis mismatched content across different channels, they'll most likely start to distrust, distrust the information, which can equal no bookings. Next, we will go into what makes a good booking.com page. First, your content has to inspire them. We like to follow the principles of the ARCH framework. The A and ARCH standing for accuracy. How are your facilities accurately ticked? This ensures the text we auto-generate is accurate and provides an objective view of each property. Next is relevancy. Are the photos provided relevant? How relevant is that close-up shot of the lamp in the room and an additional six photos of that armchair? Relevancy depicted show photos show guests what they are paying for. Next is completeness. Missing content creates doubts, which in turn leads to potential guests simply cl clicking away. You could also be missing out on a sales opportunity because you are not showing an amenity that the guest is looking for. And in some cases, it's something that you actually have. High quality. High quality images make sure you look just as good on a desktop as you do on a tablet or mobile phone. Your Booking.com page, a joint effort between us and you. Booking.com takes care of the layout based on our experiments and a few other parts. These things can't be influenced by partners, but they are a result of thousands of experiments where the winning version has stayed and been tweaked over time. Others are user generated, like guest reviews. This is a very important part of Booker's decision making. And others are directly influenced by partners themselves. These include photos, which have a huge impact on our users. Our algorithm generates your description based on the info in your extranet. On booking.com, we are able to translate up to 43 language, languages. Our content is updated overnight when any info is changed and it is uh, optimized for best for search engines. We have two main ways of seeing what works best for our properties. 
We can see what different types of guests like because they share useful information with us, like group size, location, and intent. Booking.com also runs hundreds of A-B experiments every day, two variants presented to two random groups of users. If there is a big difference in the way they perform, the winning variant stays. They're meaningful experiments because of the huge numbers of visitors we get, which equals a lot of clicks, actual spending behavior. We can tell where they are browsing from, if they're using a mobile, a mobile device or desktop, if they're searching as a family or a couple, and then which filters they use is what they click, et cetera. Once you add together all the millions of users, we can see what works on the website and what people respond to. All of this is to benefit our guests and our partners, which equals improvements we make positively impact their sales in the future. Partners have no influence on this, however, and these are determined internally. The property page score is weight weighted towards the elements that, ha that have most impact on conversion. It is an easy to use tool that suggests quick improvements you can make to attract more bookers and improve your guest experience. Next, we will go over how to use your page to increase bookings. Think about the entire cycle of a trip. It starts with day the daydreaming phase, conversations with friends, seeing inspiring images in films or online, advertisements, et cetera. They, then when there are a more concrete intent, they start to plan, researching the destination and properties, reading reviews. After that, there's a booking stage, actual click route through making a transaction. Once they experience their trip, there's a sharing element. Here, guests live, leave a review, maybe while on holiday, they might post pictures on social media, et cetera. Online content is linked to pretty much every phase here. Your online content needs to capture the people in the dreaming phase. Social media is quickly becoming a top source of travel in inspiration. Browsing through friends' holiday photos on Facebook and Instagram is more than just entertainment. It often inspires a future trip. While travelers look to several channels when deciding where to go, social media is rapidly becoming a top source. Currently, a third of U.S. travelers take to social media when considering a trip. Different social media platforms influence users in distinct ways. For example, Friends' Facebook photos attract more than 50% of users' travel plans. Whether a location is Instagrammable also matters. 40% of UK millennials consider how photo-worthy a location is when deciding where to go. In conclusion, your photos need to be attractive. Try and build a presence online and on social media. Get people spreading the word for you so others can be inspired to book with you. In an Everbright survey, 78% of millennials born between 1981 and 2000, more or less, stated they'd rather have a desirable experience over a desirable item. While on a trip, 60% of travelers share photos. For millennials, that figure is 97%. You can promote your property by encouraging them to use branded hashtags with your property name. Some properties offer discounts or other rewards in exchange for guests included branded hashtags. Booking.com also tries to capture people in the dreaming phase with things like the unpacked articles. These aim to inspire people to travel and book. People look at photos first, eye tracking. This is your opportunity to get their interest. Otherwise, they'll just look at another property. Remember, remember the Tinder style slide from earlier. Dreaming and planning are only Dreaming and planning photos are key with both stages. While it takes 60 seconds to read 200 words, it only takes 0.1 seconds to understand a visual scene. People look at photos first. I. The next stage is planning. We've established that photos are critical to your online presence. 
but how best to use them. They should, they should show the entire property. The more doubt in mind of the user, the less chance of a booking. Ideally, they take guests through the property in a logical way. For example, front of the building, shared areas, rooms, bathrooms, then views. Try to accommodate different types of guests. For example, for business bookers, show business facilities, and for families, show game rooms. Think about what makes you different from your competitors and highlight that in your photo. While professional photos work best, they're not always necessary. Smartphones nowadays should be cap compatible of taking good photos, good property photos on their own. Here are some examples of how property photos can be vastly improved. Imagine the impact of hundreds th and thousands of users over time. This change should translate into a lot more bookings. Faced with such a wide variety of places to stay, guests often use filters to narrow down their search. While you can't directly influence filters like review score, make sure your facilities and amenities are correctly ticked. If you don't appear in searches with filters, the booking will end up going to a competitor. Also consider that different bookers may have different search pri priorities and criteria. Make sure to cover information that will address to different segments. This is the new section of the property page score. Based on our data per property type, we now have a list of the most popular rooms, facilities, room facilities and amenities. You can also search for the most popular amenities among bookers from your region. This tool is a good way of checking your content is correct and up to date, and B, seeing where you could potentially invest to improve your property based on what guests are looking for. Room photos are important to reassure guests during the booking phase. They can see exactly what they're buying. Rooms without photos on booking.com are usually ignored altogether. It's also important to show all possible bed configurations. If it's a double twin, include photos of a double bed and, and also two singles. This helps to set expectations. In the sharing stage, your property page is mainly about setting the right expectations. It's important that your guest experience match or exceeds those expectations. Nasty surprises always have a major impact, and this ends up reflecting in your review score. However, if you combine met expectations with a great guest experience, they'll most likely leave a good review. Whether or not it's a good idea, whether or not they do, it's a good idea to reply. Negative reviews can be turned on their head with good, measured, empathetic reply that other guests see later on. Tips for Some tips for replying to negative reviews. Keep it short, get straight to the point. Be personal, individual replies are more sincere. Keep it polite, guests appreciate friendliness. For example, if you have a double twin room and your only picture of those rooms has a double bed, guests who arrive and find two single beds might end up annoyed. This then translates into poor reviews. Remember that your page has a ripple effect beyond the people who use it. Their experiences then get shared with others. So in fact, your audience includes your audience's audience, their friends, followers, and anyone who sees their social media activity. If you have any additional questions after this presentation, the best place to go is partner.booking.com page. By searching your property page content, you will be provided with multiple articles and links for your reference regarding anything content related. We want to thank you so much for joining us today for this content webinar, and we look forward to sharing more webinars with you in the future.